is up youtube welcome back to my world that is so liz it's your girl liz and today i'm coming with the get to know me tag kind of like all about me so you guys can sort of get a feel of who i am and whatnot so i googled um you know this tag and there are about 371 questions but we know i'm definitely not going to answer 371 questions so i'll just pick um a few that actually stand out to me and then i'll just sort of tell you a little bit about me and hopefully you know we get to know each other a little bit better if you want to please leave a comment down below and let's um sort of kind of interact with each other it'd be pretty cool to get to know the people that watch me so that we can really get to know each other pretty well so with that being said question number one says what is your full name um i actually really like this question so my screen name is that so liz for a reason years ago say about 2011 2010 um I got like Instagram and stuff and I was trying to figure out like what would I, you know, name my screen name and stuff like that. And so I wanted to sort of incorporate my first name and my middle name um, together. And then I thought it'd be kind of creative to sort of do that so Liz because my first name is Raven and my middle name is Elizabeth and I sort of go by Liz, Lizzie and stuff like that. Um, so it was sort of like a cool way to um, combine both names without actually saying both names. And um, since I kind of go by my middle name, um, that's sort of where that soul is kind of came from. So the next question says, are you named after anyone? Technically, yes. If we're going to say that I'm named after somebody, my mom did name me. Well, she, she said to me once that she did name me after Raven Simone because she would love her on the Cosby show. She always says that if her next child was a daughter, she was going, was another daughter, she was going to name her Raven. So that is where Raven came from. Elizabeth came from my great grandmother. Um, I was born on her birthday. So my dad actually chose my middle name to be Elizabeth after her. Where are you from? Originally, I'm from Washington, DC. I grew up, um, for a little bit a part of my life there i moved to maryland when i was six years old and i've been here ever since who did you look up to growing up growing up i really looked up to um who i looked up to a lot of people i really really love michael jackson he is like my all-time favorite ever um janet jackson the jacksons in general really um i grew up loving them and watching them i um also looked up to i mean because i was like a big disney channel kid and stuff like that so of course i looked up to raven simone that was one of my that's where Raven was actually one of my favorite shows on um disney channel so um definitely raven simone kiki palmer she's like she's a queen what are your favorite things about yourself i truly do i love my um humor I'm very like I'm like a really silly person I love to make the people around me laugh I love that I'm kind of like um, kind of quiet but then I'm also like very outgoing at the same time I'm sort of like an introverted extrovert what relative was important to you growing up and why I really love my grandmother um, I my father's mom I was really really close to her she she actually passed away but I, she was really really important to me she was like my sacred lady she was like my savior if anybody you know was you know doing me wrong she was definitely the one that was there to be like listen i got you you know my mom used to scare me my grandmother used to like save me and let me stay in her room and i love i love that about her what is your best physical feature so my best physical feature i think are my eyes my dad gave me the best eyes in the whole entire world so i love that about me what is your biggest accomplishment my biggest accomplishment would definitely have to be graduating because i definitely felt like since i didn't have any of my best friends my senior year i kind of felt alone and I but that was sort of like motivation for me to like do what I needed to do to get out of school what is your biggest fear so my biggest fear is never having something to show my parents to like make them proud what inspires you I think life in general inspires me what has required the most courage of you in your life so far doing this doing YouTube is actually something that like requires the most courage because I'm not the most um, confident person and I'm very like self-conscious and stuff like that so I just kind of feel like doing this will break 
you know, the ice, kind of like break my shell and get me out of, you know, the shy person that I kind of am. So this is actually very courageous for me. It's, it's, it's easy to sit in front of a camera and talk, but to actually put it out on the internet where everybody has an opinion about you, that's, that's something that requires a lot of courage. Who is your favorite actor? So the answer to this question, it didn't really change, but it kind of did. So my favorite actor is Terrence Howard. All day, every day, I've probably seen everything that he's ever done as far as television and movies and everything. Like, and I listen to his music because he sings. He's a great, great, great artist. And I love, well, everybody knows he sings from Empire Dub, but that was, he was definitely like my number one. But now that like Black Panther came out and I just realized that I knew Chadwick Boseman from so much of his work, Chadwick Boseman is, Chadwick Boseman is like probably my favorite actor right now he is everything he is so beautiful he is just oh, i watch black panther almost almost every day and that is dedicated kind of stalkerish but kind of dedicated as well who is your favorite actress now i only have one favorite actress like nobody trumps this woman to me because she is everything to me queen latifah all day every day like i could watch any of her movies over i used to watch hairspray every day that's like that used to be i just love her so much who is your favorite musician obviously michael jackson he's my all-time favorite musician singer dancer oh everything he's awesome what is your favorite music genre i don't think that i have one favorite music genre but if i listen to something the most it would probably have to be like r b and like soul I love oldies and I love 90s R&B. Um, and then I love like 80s pop. I don't know. It's crazy. That's the key. That's the way to my heart is music. What is your favorite quote? So my favorite quote is before you judge me, try hard to love me, which is a line out of the Michael Jackson song um, Childhood, which is my favorite Michael Jackson song ever. I want to get that tattooed on me, um, but I really, really love that um, quote because it speaks volumes. What is your favorite type of clothing? Hmm. I'm such a girly girl, but I'm like, a, I'm like very laid back. So it's like, I like to be dressed up and in full glam and I like looking pretty and I like looking sexy. But on a regular day, honestly, I'll just wear like sneakers, jeans, and like a big old t-shirt. That's, that's my style. What is your favorite way to pass time? My favorite way to pass time, honestly, this is why I'm kind of glad that I'm doing this right now, is like watching YouTube videos. I could watch YouTube videos all day. What was your favorite TV show when you were a child? Oh, and you guys can answer this question as well. What was your favorite TV shows growing up as a child? So... I used to love like um, All That and Keenan and Kel and Doug and Rugrats was like the best show that you could ever put on television. If you had more courage, what would you do differently in your life now? So if I had more courage differently, something I would do different in my life is probably Sing Still. Yes, I sing still, duh, like, you know, in the privacy of my own home. But it's like in front of like a crowd of people, heck no, I'm, I can't, I can't do it. I'm just too, I'll get a frog in my throat, I can't do it. Who sent the last text message you received? My best friend just texted me. And she just texted me again. That's so funny. Who would you tell first if you found a dead body in your garden? The police? How many tattoos do you have? I currently have four tattoos. I plan on getting more, but um, that's for another video and explanation of my tattoos and stuff like that. What female celebrity do you wish was your sister? Hmm. Kiki Wama could be my sister. She's my soul sister. What is the first movie you've ever seen? Probably because it traumatized me is Carrie. Thanks, Mom. What is the first time you were allowed to put makeup on? This is funny. So the first, I remember the first time I ever wore any kind of makeup was probably about 10th grade. I wore eyeliner at school and I was like scrubbing my eyes trying to get it off before um, the end of the day because I was like, my mom is gonna kill me if I come home with eyeliner on my eyes. But the first time I was allowed to put on makeup probably was like 12th grade. My mom bought me some makeup for Christmas. 
Who are some of your favorite YouTubers? I'm really into like family um, YouTube channels or like family vlogs and stuff like that and stuff. Um, so I would probably say my favorite YouTubers would be Gay Babe TV, The Daily Davidsons, I watch The Levine Life, I watch Nikki Tutorials and James Charles and Jeffree Star. I love watching The Fine Brothers, The React Channel. I love watching um, Good Mythical Morning. I have a lot of, I have a few favorite YouTubers. So my last question is, um, if you were another person, would you be a friend of yourself? Hmm, I think, I don't know. I'll be like, like she's so quiet. Like she's so, she doesn't talk, like she's weird. She, don't, she doesn't talk to people like, you know, why is she always quiet? So I don't know. Or if I was another person that would walk up to me and then realize that, um, that I am actually a cool person once you get to know me once I like break out of my shell. So that is it. Um, before you leave this video, please be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up. If you haven't already, please join the squad and subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video and I'll see you next time.